Hey guys, welcome back to another tutorial video. Uh, today we're going to be talking about the dynamic follow button um, available as a Twitch extension through Twitch. So let's go ahead and just jump right on into it. Okay, so like I mentioned, this is another Twitch extension that we're talking about. So the first thing you're going to need to do is be on the Twitch website and go on over to your creator dashboard. From there, we want to hop down to extensions. And the extension we are working on is the dynamic follow button. So you're just going to go ahead and search dynamic follow button. So there's two options. We're working with this one, not the second one. This is the one we want. So make sure you've hit installed. I've already installed it for the purpose of this tutorial video. From there, we're going to go to my extensions and get this configured. I already have it activated, actually, and I use it on my stream. Um, but so I'm going to show you the how to configure it. We're going to hit the gear right here. So this one is really easy. First and foremost, you have a heading um, that can be displayed on the stream. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and make it follow. And this is how it'll look like right here. You can have it show avatars, not show avatars. So you can see what it means. It's the profile image of the user. And you can also have it show descriptions which is basically their bio. I would not recommend doing that because you saw how that looked. And then this is how it's going to look after you add people. So basically it'll be the user. If you have the profile image, their profile image and a follow button, you can go ahead and add these users just by typing their channel name. So I'm going to type in, um, stream a friend of mine, Edgar Allen Rollo. Maybe I want to also promote him on my stream. So there we go. Now it has these two follow buttons that will overlay over and to remove it, you just hit the X button. We're going to go ahead and hit the save changes after that, but that is how you're going to add these individuals. Just like that. And we're going to go ahead and close. The last step is you can have this work in one in two ways. You can set it as the overlay, a component, or a panel. I highly recommend setting this as your overlay um, or a component. They're kind of the same thing where it appears um, over on top of your stream instead of in the panels that's kind of why it's really nice to have instead of as a panel since the follow buttons are already down by your panels this is directly on top of your stream and right in their face to remind them to follow you um, you only have two components and one overlay do keep that in mind when you are setting these up um, so you only have so many options but this is just a nice small easy extension so you can try and get some more followers i know twitch followers are not always the most important metric at times but still a good thing to do to try and encourage or you can promote other friends as well um, with this application but thank you guys so much for watching um, and of course just being here i hope this video helped if you have any questions on anything please ask in the comments below i'm happy to answer them or you can pop into my twitch stream or discord to ask me directly the links for those are in the description below and remember to sub if you want to see more tutorial videos of course happy streaming guys